it's Hannah and today I have my back to school supplies haul for you all. Um, I recently just went shopping yesterday for the last few things that I need for school and I decided to show them with you here. They're all right here. Um, and a lot of you have been asking for locker organization or just organizational things for back to school and I should be up soon but first I decided to show you what I'm getting. So all of this is from Target and a few things are from Office Max as well and I'll tell you why I get them and just like what I'm doing. Of course follow your school supply list. I did mine too. Let's get started. So I guess I'll start off with what I just got at Office Max or I'll just go buy folder binder that type of thing um, and tell you where I got it. So first I'll start off with folders I guess and these took me forever to find. I had to go to Target near the Target near me didn't have them. Then we went to another Target they didn't have any folders like that I like. They were all just plain and they didn't have the little holes on the side like you have to punch them out but they didn't have these little things on the side, uh, so you can put them in your binder, which is what I use them for. And then we went to Office Max, and they didn't have any. And then we went to the Target, another Target, um, the third Target, and then we finally found some. So I just have these three watercolor ones. That's the name of them, and I really like them because they're really simple, but they're pretty. Um, they got that one, a striped one, and then like this cool one. So I got three watercolor folders, and then these two regular striped pocket folders. There's a teal striped and a navy striped. Oh, and I haven't even opened them up yet. Whoa! First time opening it up. Um, it has three pockets here, which is pretty awesome. And then it's polka dotted on the inside. Let's see what this one looks like. On the inside of this one, oh, it has green polka dots. Super cute. And then I guess I'll go on to notebooks, which I got at um, Target. First I got this one that matches, hold on I gotta go down. First I got this one that matches this one, it's like the watercolor as well. And it's not very sturdy, it's from Med, Mead, whatever that brand is. Um, but I thought this would be good just to sort of have around. And then my favorite folders and my favorite brand to get school supplies from is from Five Star. Um, this is their folders, I have a pink one and I got a green one. And Five Star it says guaranteed to last all year. Um, and these are super thick, so I'm sure they're going to last. They have like the little orange tabs in them, which I don't really care for, but I mean, I don't really care about that. Um, and I got a wide rolled because I have such big and messy handwriting that I have to use wide rolled. Otherwise, it, um, it doesn't, my handwriting doesn't fit because it's big and messy. So, I got two of those, which are so sturdy, and these are great. I definitely recommend them. And then I picked this one up too at Target. I didn't even realize this when I got it. When I got home, I did. Um, it is the Up and Up brand, like Target's brand of the five star one. So it says like compared to the five star from Med or Mead, whatever you call that. Um, but and it got this one in yellow. It doesn't say five star because it's from the Target brand, but it's basically the same thing. It has the little orange stuff and it's super heavy duty, it looks like too. And then, let's see, what else? Oh, I just got from Max. I got these, like, five pocket folders because it said I needed these for English. They can't fit in your binder, which stinks, but I don't know what she's going to use them for. So I just got them in teal, purple, green, blue, and yellow. That's, yeah, I know that's better. It hurts my legs, though. So I got those from Office Max. And then I got this, these little five-tab dividers, also from Office Max. They just have five little tabs that you put in your binder. And then there's three of these, and these are lifesavers. I just label them as either homework, test quizzes, assignments, handouts, papers, whatever it is, they're amazing for, to use. And then also from Office Max, I've never seen this or used this before, but it looked pretty cool. Um, it is this thing from In Place. It's a binder insert, and basically it just gives you extra pockets, like additional storage po pockets, business card holder. Uh, just all these little things, if you can see the little picture. It's just supposed to give you extra pocket space in your binder, so I just got one of these because I've never tried them. I just got two things of paper. I don't know where I got this, but again, wide ruled because I like that. And we go through so much paper in my school, um, in my classes, in math alone. We go through two to three pieces of paper a day, like pieces, not front and back, like two to three a day. Um, so it's really good to have paper, and I should have gotten more. I'll get more before school starts or later in the school year. But I just got 275 stacks for now. And then I'll just go into some binders, I guess. I got my, these first three binders at Office Max. The, they're just the heavy-duty ones, the plastic. This one is just a white two-inch binder, um, because I needed a two-inch for one of my classes, it said, and it has the D-ring inside. And then I got 
to uh, one and a half inches for some other classes that said that. I got a light green, this really pretty green color. And then also this really like fun teal, not really teal, it's like aquaish teal color and they both have that inside, one and a half inch. And then from Target, again, I looked at two Targets, but until we found them at the third Target, which was farther away. But okay, I was looking forever for these. You if you've been watching at Back to School Supplies hauls, a lot of beauty gurus have been getting these big ones with the polka dots. My target close to me has like the little binders and the notebooks with the polka dots, but they didn't have these big binders, which is what I wanted. Um, but I found them eventually. These are just one inch binders, a blue and a orange with polka dots. I don't really need these, but I thought they're just good to have on hand in case later in the year I do. And then I just have two composition books. I didn't mean to get two. I got this one at Target first. This is just a wide ruled one with just like a print on the front. But I saw this one at Office Max. This is a five star one. Um, and it looked way more sturdy, so I decided to get it. The reason I love this five star one is because instead of having paper or co cardboard for the flaps, this is plastic, like a plasticky thing. So I know this is gonna last. And I'm I love five star. Get enough. So I'll start off with these pencils I got at Target. These are the mechanical pencils because these are so awesome. I love mechanical pencils because you don't have to get up in the middle of a test or anything to sharpen them. And the reason these grabbed my eye before I saw anything else, these colors are adorable. Um, the colors are like the best color colors of pencils I've ever seen. They're so cute. Um, but also it's because it says longest leads available and I'm that girl who always runs out of lead in my mechanical pencil and you can buy the little lead refills. I have some. I just leave them at my house and forget them when I come home. So I'm always the girl asking, does anyone have lead? And then a lot of times they give it to me, but sometimes they don't because I use it up real fast because I click the pencil and then it'll break and yeah, but that's how the story goes. But so yeah, I decided to get these because they have the longest leads available, I guess, and they had such cute colors and they're and then I got these actually pre-sharpened pencils in this fun rainbow color. Again, bright colors. Love them. Um, and I thought these were these were already sharpened, so I thought that was pretty cool. And again, cute colors of pencils. Like, what up with that? Then I got some pens. These Pilot G2 Fine Point Seven pens. And then this just comes with a black, pink, blue, orange, and green. I like the black to write in for on tests and quizzes. We can use that or pencil. But then the colors I like using for writing notes because it just makes them look cuter and it's more fun and it's fun to doodle with. Change out different colors for notes and things. And these are gel. And then I just got a packet of good old red pens. These are just paper mates and it says now smoother ink. So all these like things like longest lead, pre-sharpened, smoother ink it's just like awesome they're gonna help me they keep getting better and better and then I got some highlighters because we have highlight our books sometimes if they're like old books or highlighting highlighting your notes or something assignments these are just the big chisel tip chisel tip because I hate it I usually have the thin tip like not the thin tip but the regular size and I hate it when you have to go over your word like you write something out but the tip of your highlighter is too small that you have to go over it twice to like highlight the whole thing drives me insane. So I got chisel tips. I don't have to worry about that this year. Comes with an orange, yellow, and pink highlighter. Some erasers, some cap erasers, and erasers like this because again I'm always asking for cap erasers. So I decided to get some. There's not a lot in here. I'll probably have to pick up more but just to start out with. And then I saw this at Office Smacks. I thought these were really awesome. They're neon sharpies. Apparently new. Fine tip but they're sort of like the regular size sharpie but they're neon. So there's like a yellow, pink, blue, green, and orange, and I thought these would be fun to like label with. I don't write with these in school because they bleed through and they're just really messy for writing with, but I like if I'm decorating something at like home basically is what I got those for. And then to keep all of that lovely writing utensils, I got this pencil case from Target. Um, I like how it has the ring so you can put it in your binder. That's nice too, but I usually just carry it around with me from class to class since I have multiple binders. I have a binder for each class about um but it's just like this rainbow chevron which i thought was really cute and it's nice because it's like that plasticky feel like a rubber it's rubbery you know so if i get markings on it it won't be like fabric or anything and then one of my favorite things to get because i use this so much during the school year this is a planner from green room i used this last year actually my old one from last year's over there um but the reason I love this one is because it's like 60 to 70% recycled, it said. It's like good for the earth. But it also has so much room in here. It has the tabs for the months. 
so like August okay it has the month it has a section for notes um, another section to oops another section to just write notes in and then it also has like weekly so you can write down your homework for that day and more room for notes and it has like a what else is this oh, it has the holidays you can write down your school schedule holiday tab for like when holidays are more notes contacts resources and a map how more convenient in this little book my school actually gives me a planner because they recommend like being organized and stuff but it's not that cute and it's really big and bulky and I like to carry mine from class to class so I just get my own little cute one and then just some random enemy stuff um I just got some index cards because these are good to keep at your house to do flashcards that's what I use them with and then just uh white out because I've never actually used white out at school but now I got it to keep in my room for when I'm working on projects and stuff I may bring it to school I don't know and then I just got this cute little thing, which has some bobby pins in it. Uh, this is like a little container, and it just comes with the bobby pins already in it. And I thought this would be great to keep in my gym bag to pull my hair back. These at Target, and I thought these were super cute. I've never seen them before. These, they're these My Endology. I don't know what that is, but it's like that. Um, and they're basically little flashcard rings, so they have different colors here. And they're on a little ringlet, so it's sort of just like portable flashcards that are just already made out for you and just you just write your stuff on so I thought that was pretty cool and then I just got this thing for my locker utility cup I just keep my calculator in here and um, like pen, extra pencils and stuff like that and then my other I got two locker dividers which you'll see in my locker organization video and a mirror which you'll also see in my locker locker organization video it's over there though first I gotta show you my backpack right here ladies and gentlemen um, I got it from PB Teen, Pottery Barn Teen. I'll leave a link below to it, to their website. They have furniture and a lot of my furniture and stuff's from there too. But I love it so much. It is the Gear Up Dotty Zigzag. Um, it just has like dots of chevron rainbow. It has like this bright purple color. And I love it because it has so many pockets. It has two side water bottle holders, a pocket up here for like your phone, this big massive pocket here, um, a pocket here here and then a little thing in here too so there's so much room my fa other favorite thing about this is that the back is cushioned like it's spongy and it's so soft and so are the pad the arm things they're padded too so when you're wearing it even if it's like super heavy it's still comfy and it's not like oh it's like light so it's not really light but it's at least doesn't hurt it doesn't like rub into your back or skin so it's so comfortable to wear and I definitely recommend this I'll leave the link below to it um and now for the last thing um, that I got today, actually. I'm so sorry for this. Are you guys ready? You'll, you see it in the background, don't you? It's right there. That's right. I got, I finally got my MacBook Pro. I, actually, I saved for this. Um, so some of my videos I've said that, that that I was saving for a MacBook Pro and I finally got it for back to school mostly for my videos not really for school work I mean I can take it to school and work on projects but mostly for you guys to edit videos and stuff with and I love it it's, it's amazing so yeah that's my haul for back to school supplies and stay on the lookout for more back to school videos leave requests for things for you all for watching see you in my next one bye I'm a legs Woo, they're asleep